describe the start of the season for UL women's basketball team. The Cajuns non-conference losses are the most since the year 2011. UL haven't lost eight times in non-conference play since 2008. Seven already on the season. Cajuns at home against Alcorn State this morning. It was the fourth annual education game. Thousands of students from across the Cadian and they got the day off to come cheer on UL. First quarter, Louisiana up six, but Alcorn State's Alexis Freeman gets the steal and dishes to Jada Hargrove for the easy bucket. Later in the corner, it's UL's Tori Swain driving. Basket, good. Well, no, not. There's the rebound and put back by Brittany Miles. Cajun's defense locked in the trap, leading the steal from Jamira Mathis, who gets the give and go right back. Cajuns up 12 at the break. Then the third quarter, Mathis has her pocket picked. Brianna Tolliver will cut the deep deficit back to 10, but Mathis able to make up for it a little bit later in the corner. She says hello to every defender on the court on her way to the bucket. Cajuns win big 67-47 as they head into Christmas break with the W. We'll head back to the Cajun Dome with Mike Carter. In just the fifth all-time matchup between the Cajuns and Alcorn State, Louisiana came into Wednesday's matchup with a focus on rebounding and continuing to build off of strong performances of late from senior Simone Fields and freshman Tyriona Doucette. The thing that I really like when we press, she's got them long arms and she gets tips and all that and, and steals and all that. So she'll be big for us. You know, we got to keep her healthy and, and uh, she's still got to learn on the defensive side, but uh, we're excited, extremely excited about her. You know, Simone did some good things defensively, I thought, you know, and that's what we've been on her pretty hard, you know. Simone's usually that kind of kid when she doesn't score, she doesn't like to do too much else, but tonight I thought she did a pretty good job of rebounding and defending. And well, The good thing about it is, you know, regular fans, when we do bad, they boo us. Uh, now we do bad, they cheer no matter what. So it's awesome, you know, and hopefully we can build a fan base here at UL, which I think we can. I think it takes a lot of different things and a lot of different people to help. But uh, I'd love to try to build it with that education game. Doucette's 16 points led all scorers on the day, but it was her 11 rebounds that made Coach Gary Broadhead the most pleased. The Cajuns will now be off through the Christmas holiday before getting back to practice on the 26th as they prepare to take on Little Rock on the 29th. At the Cajun Dome, Mike Carter, KTC Sports.